Hi, my name's Aiden Ksaitis and I'm the global creative artist of Seb Man. So what are we going to do with you today? I want the weight taken off at the back, but the length kept, but obviously it's a bit finer at the front. So what I'll do is I'll take some sections and I'll just razor it, right? So keep all the length and just take that bulk out, especially the corners behind the ear yep. and at the back. Come on through another seat. As Billy said, his hair's a little fine in the front, so I used the bust to volumize the hair a little bit and thicken it up. I also conditioned it with the smoother, which is just going to tame it down a little bit afterwards. I prepped the hair with the groom. What this is, is going to soften down the cuticle and allow the blade to glide through the hair. Start by taking a section from the recession down to just below the crown in a triangular angle. So then I created a triangular section from the crown to just below the ear. From the point just below the crown, section that off and create two more triangular shapes and repeat on the other side. This will leave you with five sections all up. Drop the first triangle and diagonally section, take it out and curve cut on the inside of the hair. This will leave length in the front of the hair and take weight out of the back. And so repeat all those steps on the other side of the head. Comb the top of the head forward and take vertical sections. Hold it at a 45 degree angle. Curve cut and get longer as you go to the front. This will flatten the crown and keep length in the front. Parting the hair in the middle, take regular square sections and just gently snip off those ends, all those dead, frizzy ends. Then I went onto the beard and I applied the groom. And I freehand cut the beard and then I used the comb on the sideburns, as you can see. Taking rough sections through the hair, apply the booster. This is going to keep the hair healthy and full. 